then again, like modern day scientists are proving like there's more to gravity than meets the eye. So this could be possible, maybe. It would be cool if it was. You know what's the most important part of gravity for me? If you jump, you what? fall and hurt yourself. Gravity stops being important Whoa. there for me. Nothing else matters. <laughs> <laughs> what about when you drop your ice cream? That's important. Ice cream is pretty important. Anti-grab ice cream for all your needs. Now look at this. They're giving you the advanced fucking technology. Here, have this very dangerous shit. Have fun. I'm sure you can imagine what's the first thing I'm gonna try. <laughs> Let's see if you do it. <laughs> what did you say? <laughs> that laugh was stupid. Ah. We'll find out soon enough. Optimize gravity. See what the fuck? You know, that shit if it's in right there. You couldn't see it because uh, nothing happens when you press the button. But I tried to attack those motherfuckers. Obviously. <laughs> But for some reason, nope, you can't attack him. How does that make sense? I don't know. I mean, it could kill you, and it may be easy to just go this way, but still. How the fuck do you know what it's called? Yeah. <laughs> just use blasting everything. Well, I'm testing out my new powers. Shit. We're stuck here. No way out. At least it's Oh, come on. How come it can't live that? Come on. We'll find another way around. I... At first I was gonna say maybe because it's too heavy, but... I don't think gravity works like that. Get Weight back. doesn't affect it's gravity. Or the other way around or yeah. something. It doesn't matter how heavy the object is. It's very complex because a light object, no it, like a smaller object, yeah. will fall the same weight as the other. So it's very complex type of shit. Yeah, so it but doesn't yeah, you really matter to, to gravity. It. Gravity affects all things the same way. If there is no gravity in your area, you should fall, bitch. God, wasn't that lucky? That fell just right. Yeah. I believe I can fly. Nope! Can't fly. <laughs> Actually, I would probably jump down and use the device on me. So I float. By the way, I have no idea how to stay put on this thing. Neither do I. I tried it, there's no fucking way. You just keep on tipping up and shit. Apparently, I, I figured out something that you gotta use the, um... No. You know, the arrow keys? You gotta use the arrow keys instead of the movement keys. Yeah, by the time I realized that, no that was so fu I was so fucking mad at that. You actually have to let go of your mouse, I think that's bullshit. It should be just the mouse, because you can aim like that anyway. Need some help here. Oh, here comes the blue love. Thanks, honey. <laughs> Medal of Honor, door fighter. <laughs> Kicking down doors wherever we go. Why does he have to be so dramatic about opening up a door? Oh no, a flashlight and weird noises. How scary! There must be aliens down, well, have down there. Maybe giant spiders or you scorpions. Have this must be why we were sent down. You have to admit though, at least they're not making it um jump scares. At least they're not doing that. Jump scares are so fucking cheap. <laughs> well, isn't that kind of the point behind them? Yeah, but nowadays horror games use only that. That's what pisses me off. This also pisses me off as well, because they both lead to the fucking same place. 
Why did you have to slow it so fast? We could have waited for that one. No one likes spoilers. You don't like spoilers. I feel like we're walking around in circles. Well, See, yeah, he gave actually, it away. I don't. It's no worse than being up in the camp. Maybe we can find a way out of here through these tunnels. Yeah, I'm sure that everyone they sent down there managed to escape. That's why they're not here anymore. What How the fuck, fuck is this shit? <laughs> you actually used it! <laughs> well, I wanted to know what the fuck it is. And I still have no idea what it is. Oh, stop crying, you bitch. Okay, what the <laughs> fuck is that? What? Let's I have find no out. clue, I've never seen it before. Oh! <laughs> Hello! Oh, strange! <laughs> it's a good thing the game warned me there's gonna be power-ups. Oh, it never did for me, I never found that shit. Yep, it never warns you, that's well, kind of my point. The game never told you there's power-ups and shit. So you gotta be an old-school, hardcore gamer to find out this shit. Just like me, I'm awesome. I mean, that would be good, but I still hold fast that trying to get new people into a medium is good. Uh, I'd still prefer Don't some... Know, man. I'd still prefer some uh, hardcore titles like Dark Souls and Demon Souls, sorry. I don't oh, want to have course, my hand yeah. handheld all the time. I want to explore and make decisions on my own. So, here's the scoop. They send us down here and, then, and now they're trying to kill us. How's that make sense? I have no fucking clue. Maybe you're, then, maybe you're in the wrong area? Well, fuck, they could have given us a warning. You probably did, but you just didn't understand it. <laughs> give them the, grav the Graveling D. Yeah, let's give them the D. Eat my D. There we go. He ate it like a champ. Ooh! So was much D. That was all you. By the way, it's so hard to see through these objects, that's kind of annoying. You can't see where you're chugging that yeah. shit. Have you ever played PsyOps? Uh, no. Yeah, real PS2 game. It was basically like uh, this, but with psychic powers. They had really good psychic power movement there. You could even stand on objects, lift them, and levitate. It was awesome. These graphics would have come in handy back in the force. Sounds cool, I guess. Why did Leo whisper that then? Hey, these will be good back at the force. I don't think you're a police unit ever. Well, it's here. not gonna exist anymore. It's almost dead. <laughs> Need to find some ammo. Jesus. It's like a mass grave down here. This must be where they dumped the bodies after the invasion. You say that, but it's no human I'm bodies, apart from that one. Not one. <laughs> so there's hope. Can't get through this. Let's find another way. Oh, thanks, Leo. <laughs> Can't get through this. Uh. Here. Yeah. Oh, should be easy to break. Use your grappling thing. Clear the passage. It sounds like he's using your Let's use your grappling D, like use your grappling dick. <laughs> oh, hey, I need to press a button just hey, to look. jump down. That should help. That makes Can't have that context sense, sensitive. Right? It's like an earthquake. So much ammo. It's almost like there's gonna be a boss fight. You had to ruin it before what happened, didn't you? Shut up. Transformers more than meets the eye. Now, I'm gonna be honest with you. I was expecting some kind of mutated creature or zombies or whatever. Just a robot. Come on. Makes you think though, why are they playing this? Now, as the game taught me earlier, uh, blue is for less gravity, red is for more gravity. You'd think making this thing heavier would work in your favor, right? Yeah. Yeah, well, not really. The blue one is what really gets them. 
Really? For some it looks reason. like it's. Oh, I thought it was stopping attacking. It stopped it moving. Look, the other guy is hitting him with the blue and it has more effect on him. How does that make sense? So I switched to no, blue. Are you sending well. him out of control? <laughs> yeah, but wouldn't making it heavier have a bigger effect than making it lighter? I would think that it looks like when you make it heavier, I would think that you'd be able to shoot out the engine and just slam into the ground. Exactly. That would have been a cool. That would have been cool. Just. That's kind of what I was hoping I could do, but no such luck. What an awesome boss fight. You just hide behind cover until it's time to shoot him. I just threw those at him all the time. <laughs> I was just like, toss, toss, toss. Yeah, well, I prefer shooting. Gone. Oh, shit. I need bit to be honest, to get into shooting, I need bigger guns. It's nothing. I'll be fine. Let's just get out of here. No, that looks bad. We need to find someone to stop the bleeding. No, it doesn't. What are you on about? Why are you injured in the flipping cutscene, but not outside of it? Fuck. They found us. Um, Gee, I wonder if the noise gave you away. <laughs> For all the tremors. <laughs> and the rumbling. I think shoot if we move. Oh look, thanks glowing. Oh really? They might shoot us if we move. Gee. Thanks for sharing that with me. What? I had no idea. Damn, these guys are so melodramatic. They're talking so angrily and macho like and screaming all the time. I can just imagine their conversation being about ponies and dicks. <laughs> Did you watch the latest episode of My Little Pony? Yeah, Flash Eye was great! <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm gonna have a lot of stuff put up in the episode. <laughs> <laughs> Not gonna like Vo, I like the loading screen. Looks cool. Mm. Hey, what happened? Is he hurt? What did they do? We were below ground. There were tunnels and caves everywhere. These saluted doors uh, have stumbled on some kind of flying robot. It attacked us. Davis got the worst of it. A robot that flies underground. Right. Look, oh, you don't believe him, bitch! Didn't you see the people filming the bath? Six and the wounded don't last long in this place. Wait, whoa, 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 slow down. How does he know yes. all this and why does he fucking care? He just came like what, yesterday? We've been here longer than oh, him. No. What the fuck? He suddenly became the quest giver. I don't know, this guy just seems to be all over the place with his motions. First he's like, hey asshole. Then he doesn't believe what happened. Despite seeing all the flipping weird shit. Past and then few suddenly days. he knows everything. And then he's like, we gotta break out. <laughs> We gotta break out, and this is how you're gonna do it. I'm like, what? It's time. Just in calm. I know what I'm doing. Guard! Guard! Oh yeah. Let's Guard trust this complete stranger. I'm sure Guard he's gonna help us out. He he can't go wrong. You. On, you, you mean try? Oh yeah, that's gonna get their attention. Come on, my motherfucker. How can these cut like the subtitles? The subtitles actually have like some things that it says. That was suicide. He just killed himself. There's nothing we can do. He wanted to save us. Can't waste this chance. Why you? Isn't he a trained soldier? Wouldn't Why make would sense he do him that in out? the first place? None of this makes any fucking <laughs> sense. He was just there to give us a quest and sacrifice himself. What the fuck? What? Well, at the same time, I think three of you could have taken him down. Why didn't you unlock yourself first, call him over, and then all three of you jump him? Yeah, what the fuck? I, I told you he's just a quest giver. He's supposed to die for some reason. Maybe they couldn't afford to pay his... Let's do it for that his... no-name guy. 
Maybe they couldn't afford to pay more for the guy that was voicing him, so they had to kill him. <laughs> it's common practice, really. Squeeze through? How fat are you, motherfucker? Look at that gap. That's not the window. <laughs> you could lay down in that shit. I think a tank can pass through that. <laughs> Next time the stealth. Oh yeah, on rail stealth. The the next best thing next to turret sections and concealments. Yes, yeah, you by have the no way, idea. In case I mean, someone mistook that. I did say cunt scenes, not cut scenes. He doesn't like that. But that's the thing. So, something like Metal Gear Solid Five and innovative stealth mechanics and shit. No, this is the true stealth experience. That guy got owned. Yep. Why is that big thug trying to fix me electricity? He's trying to fix it? I thought he was just trying to break it. Because he's doing a hell of a job breaking it. Look at him! Even with absolutely no equipment, he still runs like he's gotta take a shit! To be fair, he is injured now, but he's still running the exact same way, so I don't understand. <laughs> This is so exciting. It's like the Metal Gear thing where the camera shoves up your ass as you run. <laughs> I bet you're gonna slip a lot during this, aren't you? Actually, this is where I figured out how to do it, right? Well, I'm still gonna slip. Oh! <laughs> For a guy who was gravely wounded, he's sure doing fine. <laughs> Look at that guy getting on down there. Okay, one did step really at a time. Come on, let's go, bro. Yeah, but did you see like those little subtle animations of him when he put his foot down his head moving all that? There's some... I don't know, I get angrier when it looks like they've actually tried, but failed. It's like, oh, there's so much DOS potential. It's like you tried so hard. <laughs> Dude, what the fuck? There's no time for a blow. Oh, 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 you're helping me up. Okay, 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 let's go. I thought you were <laughs> totally doing something else. Don't go down on me like that at weird times like this, bro. <laughs> Not right now, man. Not right now. Let's jump these oh, how convenient! We can jump on those guys. It's too high. It's like no, they're smaller than the other guy. It's not like three of you, fucking chained in combat, could have taken the other one. You know what? We need to get the guys for the henchman. Uh, you know, like, no, top 100 things you shouldn't do, like, uh, st uh, walk past uh, areas that have no light in them, or uh, stand under areas where you can conveniently be jumped down on, stuff like that, so we can help them out. <laughs> that thing should never sell, spend like, time kids. celebrating. <laughs> yeah, never spend time celebrating one hit on one person. Yeah, Don't exactly. ever go down linear corridors. <laughs> If you hear a noise, investigate more than five seconds. Yeah. Actually, I want to make that now, and I'll put it at the end of the video. <laughs> yeah, just as much as you did the zombie diary. I can do De um, Dead Island then. This is why I don't get two two slaves, right? 
two slaves break out get guns. They send a fucking APC after you. <laughs> or do they actually know how dangerous you are? I don't know. Oh, I think I got the grenade launcher. Okay, time to blow that motherfucker up. Let's blow it up! Let's blow it up! Nope, oh, wait. shotgun. <laughs> that was not a rocket launcher, was it? I was pretty <laughs> sure I got the rocket launcher. Were you hoping launcher, it yeah. was? I was so fucking sure that was a rocket launcher, I swear. The shotgun made me look like an idiot. By the way, I was testing <laughs> how much damage I can take and apparently you can't die in this game. It's impossible. You just got swarmed with bullets and you're still alive. Gee, it's so nice of you to wait for the wounded guy who's killing everybody while you're just standing there. To be fair, he does kill a few. I think he's one of the more competent AI partners I've seen. Oh, a mini boss fight. Let's see how long this will take. And... dead. Wow, I I've seen that. Uh... Battling effects so well with that. I like how their heads pop. That's fun. <laughs> okay, time to take a break, I guess. <laughs> Another cutscene. Just in case you were tired from so much gameplay. What's with all these cans of soda around? Who's fucking drinking these things? Let's go. We'll get out of here Wait, what? Patch His wound is not this patched is up? Storage. How is he not bleeding all over the floor? Why is he still alive? I honestly think they forgot on his model, it's the other side. Oh no, wait. Wait, is he over the opposite side? No, he shouldn't be. Nah, he wouldn't be that lazy. There is blood, but it's right on the side of him, so you can't see it. Oh wow, yeah. did you see him look uh, through that shelf? All it has is a few bottles of wine on it. And he was looking so desperately through them. But, what you don't stand, the grab you and it was stuffed behind it. Yeah. It was just right out the corner. Nice. <laughs> that shotgun must have been pretty fucking well hidden for him not to notice it. <laughs> Let's open the door all dramatic like. That's all the only way we know how to do it. Let's find a lift to get down into the case. Is it just me or do do you like rain in games? Well I like it but not always. Hmm. Oh no, I love rain games. That just makes me feel so lovely. <laughs> Leo, what are you doing? That thing can't do nothing to you. Do you see this shit? You are literally cutting a slot of destruction through their main base. Yeah. Pew pew. <laughs> Quickly, go to the site. They never suspect that. <laughs> What elevators? Oh, that elevator. Why do they have to be so <laughs> dramatic about everything they do? That's so annoying. You're trying to, to be hard, fair, guys. No, seriously, these guys are fair, such though, tryhards. Wouldn't you flip in, um, adrenaline pumping by this point? I'm getting shot at, there's aliens around, I can control gravity. Dude. If my life consisted of so many cutscenes, I'd kill myself. <laughs> Actually, that's a good point. Do you think game characters in cutscenes have no control over themselves? You know what? I can just imagine they, them they standing there. Realize. I can just imagine them standing there during the cutscenes like motionless dolls, having not, no emotions, no anything. Just standing there 
in stasis and just watching everything happen around them while they why while they're stuck in limbo or something. Their bodies moving on their own and everything. God, that would be horrible. <laughs> Oh yeah, that turned in my butt, man. <laughs> okay, how does... You said he's an intelligent NPC, how is that intelligent? I'm behind cover, shooting at, the ten, at an enemy, and he decides to cock block me by jumping over me. What the fuck? To be fair though, there have been worse NPCs. That's what I'm getting at. So, I can basically stand behind this thing all day, they're not gonna hit me, and I'm not gonna die. And I don't even have to pause the game, I can go and do whatever the fuck I want. To be fair, I think that's why one of the grab mechanics actually came in, so they could use it against you. But you never gave it a chance, because you killed their captain. <laughs> did, I mention how did I mention how awesome headshots are? I love them. What the fuck is that? Oh, about a fuck ton of C4, okay. Hey, this is the future. Maybe it's C5. Oh, of course. So different from C4. Just Way different. What? You want to block our exit? Hell yeah. Glowing shit. Oh, it recharged your... Yep. Um, Thing. But I hope this Didn't look at it now. Now then, how can what, we exit? Why did you do that? Because we have to make a manly <laughs> exit. Let's not hang to find look, out. let's be honest. They kick open <laughs> doors. <laughs> They give each other footsies. If they're gonna run away from the base, it has to be in a very manly order. And the only manly order to leave a place is by blowing it the fuck up. That's how it's done. Oh yeah, that was very manly. Yep, that's how it's done. What do you mean head start? That's what they were gonna do anyway to open up the chasm. Yeah, so yeah this free is, man. This is where we split up. Thanks again. Couldn't have got out of there without you. Are you crazy? Wait. I'm going with you. I'm gonna go find your daughter. No, I'll move faster on my own. Like hell you will. Fuck you, you're injured, you're asshole. Couldn't have got out there alone. Now you're thinking of going in there solo? No. I don't know, I'm liking the sure deal much more than Davis. No. It's like, I'm gonna leave you, my best friend. And Leo's like, no, fuck no, I'm coming with oh, you. Oh, come on, let's be honest. The only reason this cutscene is happening so they can make us feel something about the partners and about them being all uh, honorable and shit. This is just bullshit. Anyway, it's time to end the video, so do you want to say any goodbyes? No, fuck you all, I hate you. Goodbye, everybody, he loves you really. All clear behind us. God, look at this. There's nothing left. Yeah. I can see. And hey, there are survivors out there. We'll find her. Yeah. She's still there. Somewhere. So many people. Yeah. Yeah. I hope things look better where we used to live. Things look so different. I can't even tell where we are. Come on. Home's this way. Sesame with the steel on my toe.